What would it look like if we called a truce with cannabis, as we seem tantalizingly close to doing? So my team and I just published a study looking at over 600 medical cannabis users from across the country. These are people with many of the conditions that characterize the use of cannabis for therapeutic purposes. People with serious conditions like cancer, AIDS, multiple sclerosis, arthritis, chronic pain. And what we found was that in addition to treating some of the distinct features of these disorders, people were using cannabis for three primary reasons to help sleep, to reduce pain, and to alleviate anxiety. A few decades ago, neuroscientists discovered that we have our own system in our brains and throughout our bodies that is uniquely tuned to working with cannabis and cannabis-like substances. It's called the endocannabinoid system. And we've also found that there's a concentration of activity of this cannabis system in the amygdala. That's the part of the brain that's focused on processing anxiety, fear, and the emotional content of fear.